Hey everyone, thanks again for tuning in to Vintage Pokey Openings. For those of you who are unfamiliar with my channel, I open vintage Wizards of the Coast era Pokemon products for our enjoyment. If you see in the background here, what we're going to be taking a look at today is a sealed base set 2 lightning bug theme deck. You can see there's the box. So I bought this for the low price of $55 from a seller on eBay who lives in Istanbul, Turkey or at least that's where it was shipped from. And part of the reason why I got it for such a great price is because as you can see, the box has damage down here at the bottom. This is not where the cards are, however, the cards are up here. So I don't think that the damage on the box would affect the integrity of the cards. But still a really cool piece of Wizards of the Coast history nonetheless. I believe we've opened one other base set two theme deck on this channel, and that was the Psych Out theme deck. That was the first opening I did for this channel. So we're gonna take a look at this theme deck here and see what is included. The one thing that is always cool about the base set two set is that's when they transition to using the Cosmos holofoil, which I think is much prettier than the holofoil they used on the original, such as like the base set, the fossil, the jungle set, so on. So let's open this up and see what we can find. You can see on the back, we comes with 60 cards, a Pokemon coin, damage counters, rule book, and a card list. Pretty standard for Wizards of the Coast theme decks. The theme of this is grass and lightning, as you can see. Let's take a look at what's in here. All right. So we've got the advanced rule book version one. Look there, there's the boulder badge from Pewter City Gym. Yeah, I always get a kick out of these materials and the promotional ads that they'll put in them and whatnot. Always so close to see, so nostalgic from when we were kids, you know. These were the days. Going to the local store, getting a pack of Pokemon cards. So we've got the damage counters here, as you can see, used in the training card game. And then we have the base set two card list. <clears throat> if we open this up, you can see there are the other theme decks in base set two. So we have Grass Chopper, Lightning Bug, Psych Out, and Hot Water. So only two more of those until I've opened all of the base set two theme decks on this channel. So cool card list there. All right, and the next thing we have are, whoop, we have the Pikachu coin. I think this same Pikachu coin came in all of the base set two theme decks. Because I've got another one of these and I think it's from the Psych Out theme deck. So I'm gonna set that off to the side. And then we have our cards. So there we can see is the base set two holographic Chansey, which is the hollow in this set. So I'm gonna go ahead and unpackage this appropriately and we'll take a closer look at this card. Okay, so we'll take a closer look at this card here. So the centering on the front is pretty good for the most part. A Little bit shifted to the left, but I've seen a lot worse. Let's check the back side. Not quite as good on the back side. We've got a white nick up at the top left, white nick up at the top right. Maybe a little white nick at the bottom right, maybe a teeny white nick at the bottom left. Other than that, the surface looks okay. Let's flip it back over to the front. Yeah, unfortunately, it feels like there is some stickiness on the hollow foil, and you might be able to see it kind of looks like there's print lines on it almost, but it, I don't think it, it I don't think it is print lines. It's like this weird glue from the package. There gives you a little bit better look at the hollow foil. There's no swirls or anything, but that would have been cool. Chansey is a heavy hitter in the base set. Not quite as much in base set two, but uh, base set Chansey goes for a lot of money. So would have liked this to be in a little bit better shape coming from a sealed theme deck, but then again, it was a damaged theme deck. Who knows what happened to it? You know, it could have been bouncing around, been thrown around, who really knows? So it could be in better condition than I would expect, but. We're gonna get that in a card sleeve anyway. Beautiful holographic Chansey card there. 
All right, and for the rest of the cards in this set, we have a Pokédex, Plus Power, Defender, Energy Retrieval, Switch, and you know what, as I'm grabbing these cards, there's a lot of them that are stuck together. So I don't know if there was glue involved, but like all of the, there's supposed to be duplicates of a lot of these trainer cards there. Those weren't stuck together, but the last couple I've pulled have been stuck together. So I gotta be careful with this. Base set two, Magnemite. We're gonna have a couple of those. We got a Yellow Cheeks, base set two, Pikachu. Those actually might go for a fair amount. I'm gonna put those off to the side. There's one of our rares, Beedrill. One of my personal favorite Pokemon. I love Beedrill. I think that's so cool. I'm gonna put that off to the side as well. We've got Kakuna. A couple of them, actually. And Weedle, of course. We've got Metapod. Caterpie. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest, I don't remember these cards sticking together like this in other base sets that I've opened. So that's a bit disappointing. We're gonna have a handful of grass energy. We're gonna have a handful of lightning energy. And those are all of the cards in the theme deck. So once again, the hollow from this set is Chansey. And then I believe the base set two theme decks also came with a standard rare, which is this Beedrill here. So thanks again for tuning in to a VPO video. We're gonna be opening some more awesome Wizards of the Coast products in the near future here, so please feel free to like, comment, share, subscribe. Whatever you can to support the channel is greatly appreciated, and we'll look forward to seeing you next time.